In 1974, The Six Million Dollar Man captivated audiences with its portrayal of astronaut Steve Austin, rebuilt with bionic limbs and enhanced senses after a catastrophic accident. The show envisioned a future where science could seamlessly blend man and machine, creating a superhuman capable of extraordinary feats. Nearly five decades later, how close are we to achieving such technology? Can today's advancements bridge the gap between fiction and reality? Let's explore. The central premise of The Six Million Dollar Man was Steve Austin's bionic reconstruction, including 1. A bionic arm capable of superhuman strength, 2. Bionic legs enabling speeds of 60 miles per hour and incredible jumps, and 3. A bionic eye allowing zoom capabilities and infrared vision. Today, advancements in prosthetics and bioengineering have made strides toward these concepts. Bionic arms. Modern prosthetic arms such as the Luke arm and those developed by Open Bionics can restore significant functionality to amputees. Some even offer fine motor control via neural interfaces, allowing users to move prosthetic fingers with their thoughts. Bionic legs. Robotic exoskeletons like those from Exobionics and Rewalk Robotics assist individuals with paralysis in walking again. While they don't yet match Steve Austin's 60 miles per hour sprint, researchers are working to enhance efficiency and adaptability. Bionic eyes devices like the Argus II retinal prosthesis system have enabled limited vision for the blind by converting images into electrical signals transmitted to the brain. While far from Austin's zoom and infrared capabilities, technologies like augmented reality glasses and thermal imaging devices are advancing rapidly. In The Six Million Dollar Man, Austin's arm could bend steel and punch through walls. Modern bionic arms, while strong, prioritize dexterity and functionality over raw strength. Current materials like carbon fiber and advancements in battery technology suggest that enhancing strength is feasible but not yet practical for widespread use. Bionic legs in the show made Austin faster than most vehicles. While today's exoskeletons improve mobility, Achieving such speed would require breakthroughs in power sources, lightweight materials, and human-machine synchronization to prevent injury. Steve Austin's bionic eye allowed him to zoom in on distant objects and see in the dark. Modern thermal imaging cameras and AR glasses can mimic some of these abilities, but they remain external devices. Integrating these directly into the human body is still a major challenge, especially in terms of brain-computer interfacing and miniaturization. While we're not yet at the level depicted in The Six Million Dollar Man, technology is progressing rapidly. Innovations in robotics, AI, and biomedicine suggest that superhuman abilities might not remain fictional for long. However, achieving this vision will require not only scientific breakthroughs, but also careful consideration of ethical, social, and practical implications. As we move closer to a world where humans and machines merge, the Six Million Dollar Man serves as both inspiration and a reminder of the possibilities and responsibilities of technological progress. What seemed like science fiction in the 1970s may soon become part of our reality. If you enjoyed this content, be sure to check out our other videos on this channel and visit Neurophysiology Enlightenment at neuroenlight.com for more. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share to stay connected. Thank you for your support.